morning, everybody. We made it through the night. <laughs> we pulled an all-nighter with a couple hours sleep, but we got our bread done. And, um, and it rested, and, and, and I rested, and, and uh, so good morning. <laughs> Thanks for putting up with all those videos because um, I'm having technical difficulties. Otherwise, I'd be able to just split them all together. So if anybody out there um, that doesn't have Creator Studio knows of a program that I know I can go online. Don't tell me to Google. I will block you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm learning how to, uh, I don't have an, oper my operating system isn't up to speed um, to the point where I can get into Creator Studio or load any programs right now that um, help me splice all this stuff together and put it in something that is at all professional. <laughs> So anyways, good morning everybody. Cheers, Tank. Can I call you that? Yeah. So, um, so yeah, we're just um, tired, but we're gonna oh, cut the bread and I just wanted to say thanks for putting up with this. I really wanted to show you how I do it and um, it wasn't really, um, I wanted to make better videos and, and um, and I will. I'm working on it. So I didn't. A few years ago, I didn't think I was gonna be making bread um, for the world, and now I'm making bread. And so you never know what uh, where life's gonna take you. Um, but this is fun. So I have a neat um, this old. I don't know the light. Can you see? Let me see if I can turn the doesn't always work. Oh, it's like going to flash. Watch my lights flash. They're scary. Nope. I'm going to get struck by lightning. Oh, see, they go off. I don't think they're um, grounded. But anyways, this uh, cutting, um, this, can you see that it's, yeah, you can see. It's an old, really, really old bread slicer bagel slice or whatever and all thing but yeah isn't that neat and it's just attached with a screw here and a screw here and it's just a cut away and I mean it has it has some tension to it right like it's it's uh you can work with it in your bread and you can get the hang of it. I'm still working on it. So we're going <clears> to <throat> open up our bread and see what kind of crumb we got. This is our sourdough starter. Remember yesterday we were going to feed it again. But it's all bubbly. I don't know if you can see the bubbles. It's like an arrow. Oh, where's the camera? No, oh, there are the bubbles. It's all bubbling. So we'll feed it again like we did in the first video. You guys, there's 10 little three minute videos, except for the first and the seventh or sixth or something like that. But um, this is Wild Child, and she's in there and she stays the lug. We feed her, we, we can put this. Um, if you make a runnier, like a more liquid, more water than flour, um, your starter will be slower. It won't, it won't ferment and bubble up as fast. And um, once it's active, you can put it in the fridge if you're not going to make anything like chocolate cake. <gasps> We're going to make chocolate cake next. I'm going to show you how I make the... Um, um, it's based on the King Arthur Flour um, Company's chocolate cake, sourdough chocolate cake recipe. But it, I switch it up a little bit and change it and make it my own sort of with... With credits to them, of course, because it's really, really, really good. It's really easy, and I can't wait to show you. So make sure you hit the subscribe button so that you get notified when I make chocolate cake. <laughs> hit the little bell, um, you know, the little notification thing. You guys know the know the things and thumbs up and all that, right? I mean, if you like it. If you don't, move on. There's a billion people you can watch um, making bread and and. Uh, and, and stuff so you, you just do what 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 makes you happy <laughs> so let me have a sip of my coffee 
Mm. Everything is fueled by coffee here. I might have to drink from the right cup because otherwise we got people. I don't know where to put this here. This here. We got people concerned. <laughs> Not that cup. Okay, so so this is what we ended up with. I'll, I'll reenact what it looked like coming out of the pan. <laughs> I was like, oh, I sure hope it comes out. Oh! Oh, can you smell this? Can you smell it? Mmm. Can you hear it? And it's nice, right? I'm looking at squishy, too. Oh, you could just... The dough was so soft. You'll check out the little videos. They're not too long, and I'm just dorky and trying my hardest. And you can, and you can leave me a comment and tell me what all your, what all your. Can you see this? I can. You can feel it. It's just so. This is my sandwich bread, so I know it's no one's gonna want to eat it now that I've touched every piece. But I'm gonna show you what it looks like. What have we done? Here, we'll put this one here. Wait a second. We have to reveal. We have to cut it open. Goodness. Okay, we're gonna try grandma's grandma's old. Uh, look at this. Can you see? Can I appreciate this. Oh, we're gonna have to find a lab bunny to to try this out. Look at that memory foam bread. Oh, that's soft. Are there any lab bunnies in the house? Jacqueline? Yes. <laughs> My little lip pain. <laughs> Come on. Are you brave? Are you brave enough? Mm. No. <laughs> I want to know. Here's my task bunny. <laughs> we have a lab bunny. We don't use that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, looks great. I paid her. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Look how neat that slices. Grandma's slicer. Some bread. <laughs> <laughs> that was really good. Is it? Mm -hmm. Is that that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah so you will last one. Yeah? yeah. Yay! <laughs> I paid her to say that too. <laughs> okay, guys, there you go. Mom's memory foam bread. You can sleep with it too. It makes a nice pillow. Mm. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys. There you go. I don't know what else to say. It's awesome. Make your family some bread. Make yourself some bread. Make yourself some goodness and some wholesomeness. This is considered, <laughs> Jacqueline hates it when I say this, but this is live food. It's, uh, it's living food. It's living, organic, um, good, fresh, clean food for life. And so I hope you try this and um, let me know um, how you do and let me know your tips. And your, I can, you know, let me know what your favorite recipes are and let me know what you would like me to make next so I don't put my I decided I don't put my bread in a bag right away it'll make it nice and soft like if you get your crusty bread from the store and stuff the minute you put it in your in, in bread then it softens up and the, it's not as crusty but um sourdough is a beautiful bread that is um, because it's had such a high water content it's a um it it doesn't mold very quickly at all and it doesn't it doesn't go bad very quickly. But what I do is I, I cut off a piece like that and then I just put it down on the counter like that. And we eat it so fast it doesn't have time. But um, make it, it freezes wonderfully. It freezes beautifully, better than most breads. And for people that have celiac disease um, as well, um, not using any of the commercial yeast in here, it makes the same. It's the same. And... And um, people are, I don't like this video.